the compact biogas plant. Many rural households use biogas as cooking fuel. The traditional domestic biogas plants require a daily input of 40 kilograms of dung mixed with about 40 liters of water. It takes about 40 days for the dung to start producing biogas. In order to accommodate the daily input of 40 kilogram dung and retaining it in the plant for 40 days requires a plant having a very large capacity of about 4 cubic meters. Because of the large size, such a plant requires a lot of space and its cost is also high. Because of dwindling population of cattle, the availability of dung has declined, causing many of the existing biogas plants to stop functioning. Appropriate Rural Technology Institute, Arti, has developed a new compact biogas system which is very easy to use. This biogas plant works on starchy, sugary, cellulosic or fatty substances. Thus, one can use oil cake of non-edible oil seeds like pongamia, neem, castor or shoria, damaged or overripe fruits rain damaged grain, flowers swept from the floor of a flour mill, fruits of ficus, insect damaged grain, non-edible rhizomes of banana or canna, tea leaves or any other similar substance as feedstock, leftover and stale food can also be used as feedstock. The feedstock must however be pulped or ground and applied to the biogas plant after mixing it with about 5 to 10 liters of water. About one to one and a half kilograms of starchy material would yield sufficient gas to cook the meals of about four to five persons. The amount of gas generated every day depends upon the capacity of the fermenter and the gas holder. Fermenter capacity 500 liters gas holder capacity 400 liters available gas 250 liters duration of burning 1 hour fermenter capacity 1000 liters gas holder capacity 750 liters available gas 700 liters and duration of burning 2 hours fermenter capacity 2500 liters Gas holder capacity 2000 liters, available gas 1750 liters, and duration of burning 5 hours. There are various ways in which this biogas plant can be fabricated. This plant has been fabricated with the help of two plastic tanks. This one has a cement concrete tank as the fermenter and a plastic tank as the gas holder. This third model has its fermenter tank made of sheet metal. Although the fermenter tank is made of different materials, the gas holder tank is always made of plastic. <laughs>